You can't tell me there's not some bat. Oh my God. Oh my God, dude. Cody, look how big he is. Yo, what's poppin' boys and girls? Welcome back to another video. I hope you guys are having a great day. Um, it's the beginning of the week, it's Monday. I hope you guys are kicking some butt and uh, fishing some, obviously. I hope you guys had a great weekend as well. Um, if you guys went fishing this weekend, let me know how you did. Comment down below where you went, um, how many fish you guys caught. If you caught a big one, let me know. And more importantly, if you caught a big one on a kicking combo, tag your boy on Instagram at Kicking Their Bass TV. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Hit the notification bell. Also hit the like button if you guys have been enjoying the content. It really helps out the videos more than you guys know. And if you could, share this video with a friend. Get somebody into fishing. But today, we are actually doing some micro fishing. We filmed our first micro fishing lure video like probably two weeks ago. And the feedback was awesome. You guys loved it. And we had a great time. I'd have to say out of the videos that we filmed in the last three months, the micro video had to have been probably in the top three, Cody. I had a good time that day. Yeah. Like, we didn't catch a, any big fish, but we had a good time. So today we're gonna be fishing with some more micro lures, trying to find some big fish. And uh, that, that's the thing. We gotta catch a big one on a micro lure today. But I ended up stopping by Dick's Sporting Goods this morning, bought a few baits because I'm really not big into this. I don't have a ton of micro tackle. And yeah, so I'm gonna show you guys what I got, what we're gonna be rigging it up on. And then we're gonna go out to a few ponds today and try to see what we can catch. Hopefully we'll catch, you know, a little bit of everything. Some big bass, some small bass, some crappies, some bluegill, catfish, some mudfish, supposedly some freshwater eels because my man Cody smacked a weird looking one yesterday. Uh, you guys need to go check out my Instagram story for that. But yeah, we're gonna go ahead and hop into it. So let me show you guys what I bought. <laughs> All right. Hey man, can you grab him? Can you just calm down, dude? Make me anxious. All right. <laughs> I ended up buying some braid, and this is one thing I want to talk about. So, with the micro lures, we are throwing this on a Kicking Their Bass TV spinning combo. If you guys want to check them out, they're on the website, kickingtheirbass.com. Link will be down below, and you guys need to go ahead and order because if you want to receive it by Christmas, you need to order within the next week. So, if you guys want to check them out kickingtheirbass.com i greatly appreciate all y'all we also have some big bass energy merch on the website you can check that out as well but i ended up buying some of this suffix braid right here this stuff's very smooth um one thing i noticed i spooled up like three or four spinning combos three of them i put some cheaper braid on and one of them i put some more expensive you know slick braid and it was a night and day difference like the one that had the slick braid was literally beaming like i was casting the spinning rod like it was a $400 bait caster. I have no idea why, but the braid was going off so smooth. So that's a big thing. If you guys end up getting a spinning combo, spend a little extra money, get you some good slim braid um, that's really silky and can come off the reel pretty good. And uh, that thing's gonna cast like a dream. But yeah, we got some braid. We also got like three or four packs of soft plastics. We got some little swim baits right here. They're already pre-made on the jig head. And these are, It does not say the weight. If I had to assume, those are an eighth ounce. We got some electric chicken, little tiny, uh, I guess you could call them grubs. We got some Strike King little grubs right there. And that's like a pearlish blue color with some black flakes. That's actually a saucy little color. And if you guys want to get a discount on any of the Strike King baits or lose combos, links and discount codes down below. And then we got some of the Strike King Mr. Crappie chartreuse jig heads here these are 16th ounce and then i also bought some of these in eighth ounce and those are pink ones um i really wanted these in eighth that's why i ended up not buying the all of these but um i think that's gonna do the job and then lastly we got one more bait we got a mini little uh jerk bait here which is freaking sweet honestly i think uh that's definitely going to catch a few fish today we're going to have fun with it but we're just going to throw a little bit of everything and see what we can catch i have a little fluorocarbon leader here on the end of this so we're going to go ahead and rig up what are you thinking cody like if you had a gut feeling on what noah's going to smack the fish on today what would it be no i would i would throw these first you think i should throw that yeah okay the only problem i have with this one i mean the bait's not big right like the bait's not big yeah but 
Could a bluegill eat that? Could a crappie eat it? I but think a crappie so. could. I think a crappie would definitely eat it. Ma maybe not a bluegill, but that's when we'll switch up to some of those little grubs. Dude, we've caught bluegill and rage crawls. We, we have caught some really big bluegill with bass lures, but yeah, I guess that's what we're going to go with. It's just a little tiny swim bait. Nothing crazy, but I think that's going to get the job done. And by the way, if you guys have like any tips on micro fishing um, or any suggestions for your boy, Please leave them down below. I'd, I'd greatly appreciate that. I'm new to all this, but I'm just having fun, man. That's what fishing's about. Everybody gets a little too crazy with it. Your boy likes to have some fun, okay? And guess what we doing today, Cody? Having fun. We having some fun. By the way, if you haven't seen one of the last videos, we went offshore in the middle of the ocean. We were like, what, 40 miles off, Cody? Mm -hmm. And we had a great time. It, it was a fun day. We caught a lot of big fish. You guys need to go check that out. For some reason, YouTube, does not want to promote my saltwater content. And I really want to do saltwater content. So if you guys love your boy, you should go over to the video, hit the like button, comment down below, share it with a friend, and help your boy out. Cause man, Cody, that was fun, dude. Yeah. It's just like refreshing. Going out for some saltwater fish is refreshing. And I want to go for like a 10 foot shark here in the next month or so. So please help your boy out and go like that video. But we're rigged up here, got everything we need. We're gonna go ahead and head out to the first pond and try to catch some fish. Let's get it. All right, y'all, we just got out to the first place. The last time we came out here, we were fishing with bass lures. Only caught one fish, okay? But I've caught multiple six and sevens out of here. So it's a good little spot. Oh! He got me. <laughs> Man down. <laughs> My skirt. I just ripped my freaking skirt, dude. I thought you brought me out here to film you doing some fishing. You know, I thought I was gonna do some fishing today too, until I caught myself a big one. You caught yourself <laughs> slipping. I hurt my back, dude. Come on, man. Oh, you see that? Oh, no. Oh, snap, dude. Yeah. I, I kind of hooked him, but then again, this lure is so light, dude. I might be able to catch him right here. Oh, that's heartbreaking. That seemed like a big fish, too. Uh, that seemed like what we we're looking for. You see how big that boil was? <gasps> no! Okay. Zone in here, here, here. Okay, you ready? I'm, I'm catching him this time. Dude, you can't tell me that hook hurt that fish enough for him to be like, I'm not gonna bite it again. Gosh, you little turd. I caught a crappie on a jig in here. Let's go, dude. Do that. Okay. Right there. Yes! Dude, that was so cool. Called it too. Oh! Oh, no. Does that count? Dude, that was dope. That was dope. Give me some. That was dope. We didn't catch him, but maybe these hooks just suck on this thing, bro. These are like some of their like cheaper baits, you know? I need to put one of them striking hooks on. That was cool, though. Aren't you glad I told you to get Yeah, we were, we were about to leave. I like thought about it, but I was like, man, it's kind of like in the winter time. Like what bass is going to come up? But then again, it is really shallow. And it's like a bait fish. Like imagine like a bait fish getting caught up in that stuff. And dude, I, the crazy thing is... I have so much grass on it, so it adds a little bit more weight. Like I like have all this stuff on it and I'm not taking it off cause they can't see it that quick, you know? Yeah. Let's see, let's see if we can get another one. Right off the end of that grass, there's gonna be a slobber dunk. 
Oh. <laughs> Dude, if I would have fell in the water there, I would have been so upset. You can't tell me there's not some bath. Oh my God. Oh my God, dude. Dude. <laughs> dude. Yo, there's a big one with him. Dude, look how big the one is with him, Cody. Cody, look how big he is. I'm gonna fall him on the bank. Watch this, watch this, watch this. Watch this. Do you still see him? Oh my God, dude. That fish was huge, bro. That was like a four pounder. Are you kidding me, dude? That was like a four pounder. You saw it? Yeah, I did. That was crazy. So I just caught this fish, guys, and that was a sweet fight. Just hearing that drag rip just made the whole day worth it, to be honest with you. Not a bad fish at all. It's not two pounds, it's probably a high one, but Man, that's, that's a good fish to catch on a micro lure. I cannot believe there was like a four pounder with them. And oh my God, dude, I could have caught a four pounder on a micro lure. Let's, let's get back in there. But that's a nice little fish. Thank you, buddy. Dude, Cody, oh my gosh, I almost had a four pounder. That's crazy, man. I was just talking about it, guys. This pond's a little low and there's a lot of rocks. And I was like, how's there not a bass on them rocks? And I just watched one come up and eat it. Here we go, bro. I feel this cast. I have never knew that there was all these rocks here. I really didn't. Dude, that's better than the last one. He's not a giant, but he's a good one. Dude, fighting these fish in this clear water on these micro baits. Oh my gosh, look at that fatty. Dude, this is so freaking cool. Look at that little tiny bait in his mouth. Bro, this is going to get me addicted to micro fishing, dude. Like, I, I have so much fun throwing them little baits and they, they just fight so well. That's a two pounder, man. Not a giant, but that is a good fish to catch on a micro lure, man. Like we're over here expecting we're gonna catch some little tiny bass or like little bluegill. And we're over here catching some good ones, man. Gosh, thank you, buddy. <laughs> Dude, that's so much fun, man. Let's keep it going. I'm not gonna lie, this has been the funnest little thing when you cook them on this. They fight so good. Not having like a, a ton of bites, guys, but I'll tell you, man, the bites that we are getting, they're pretty good ones for, for this, and they just fight so well. And you can just see them eat it too, like in this clear, shallow water. I mean, this is just, this is dope, dude. I'm having fun. You guys should definitely go try out some micro fishing, pick you up a kick in their bass setup on the website too. Let me know uh, how you guys do and, and if you guys enjoy it, man, because this is actually really fun to me. I'm having a great time right now. This cast. Look, oh my God. He swam away. He just hit me. Oh. Not a big one, but a nice one. Yes. <laughs> he ate it right away, dude. That's what they're doing. It's like I throw it in there and they see it flutter down. And they're just choking it in the back of their throat, man. That's <laughs> so cool. I'm gonna tie on another bait here in a second, guys, but I'm still gonna cast this for a few more. See if we can get any more fish. It's a nice, pretty guy. Thank you, bud. I'm gonna catch another one right here, dude. I think they're loaded right there. Oh, 
Oh, yes. Dude, these things are fighting so good, bro. They're loaded down there. Another nice fish. Oh, yeah. He's barely hooked compared to the other ones. That fish was fighting, man. That's almost two casts in a row. They're stacked. Watch this, guys. We're going to throw right back in there. Oh. This is what I expected to catch today, to be quite honest with you. What a toad. <laughs> what in the world, Cody? Lunker. Is he 12 pounds? Just about? Every time we talk about something that probably shouldn't be on camera, we catch it. <laughs> that was a cool bite too, man. <laughs> All right, y'all, we're re retiring the swim bait for right now. We might put it back on. It's just catching them really good. But look at this thing. That has to be the coolest little bait. I'm excited about it. I think they're going to smoke it. The only problem is it is really shallow in here, but I don't think it's going to matter too much with this bait. But uh, I'm kind of pumped about this. So let's see if we can get some on this little jerk bait. Oh! Dude, I, I had it uh I had it hop back in the water and he freaking ate it. Why am I like getting so pumped up on these tiny fish, dude? Here we go. Dude, they're hammering it. It's not eating it. Oh, those are bluegill, dude. Right there. I, I really want to catch one. They should eat it technically, dude. Technicality, you know? Oh my God. I didn't even reel it, dude. <laughs> Is that small? That's smaller than the last one, isn't it? I think so. That's impressive, dude. All y'all posting these big fish pictures, dude? What you got on this, dude? Huh? <laughs> What you think? <laughs> that takes skill, buddy. You see how small his mouth is compared to a 10 pounder? 10 pounder is easy to catch, man. These things, it's a toad. <laughs> what? what in the world? I would never think I could catch a bass that small. It's crazy. Here we go. So he's gonna be bigger than that. I wanna hear that drag rip again, but <laughs> that little lure is catching him, man. That's so cool. So cool, so much fun. I guess. What a toad. What's up? I have to be proud of you right now, dude. Dude, I know, dude. I think I just need to call him up and be like, yo, call my PB like 13 times today. Dude. Get some of that, you know, dude. You know what I'm saying, dude? People are gonna be so mad at me for doing that. People get so angry, they're like, no, you say bro and do too much. I'm like, I know, bro. <laughs> like, I'll go back and watch the videos. I'm like, no, can you please really shut up? Dude, I'm unsubscribing. <laughs> like, <laughs> if you say dude one more time, I'm unsubscribing. <laughs> That's the smallest bass I've ever caught. Official, officially. <laughs> bro. That's a pet bass, dude. If we got a tank. All right, dude, we, all right. Comment down below. If we get this video, which I know you guys probably won't, but if you guys actually share this video with at least a couple of friends, we probably could make it happen. If this video gets 10,000 likes, I will come out here and I will get a pet bass. 10,000 likes, share it with a friend, share it with your grandma, your mother, your dad, your aunt, your sister, your uncle Larry. Get this video 10,000 likes and I'll come and catch us a few pet bass. That, that is the smallest one I've ever caught. It'd be cool to feed them over time and see them grow. Hey, I caught my PB. Yeah. <laughs> Literally, that's the title. It's a perfect little noise.
That scared me, dude. Scared of the moon? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh. Just poke it. I got a school of minis right here. Oh my god, it's literally... It's a school of them, dude. Stop it. Oh, you turd. Yeah. He's dead. Dude, those are some... Oh, you're about to get hammered. Oh, it's a good one. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, no. I feel so bad for that fish. He's all muddied up now. Nice, dude. Shoot. That was pretty cool. Yeah. Those are huge rocks. I never knew those were there. I saw a school of babies, like the ones you were catching. And then he came out. Yeah, again. I was expecting to catch one of those, and then he just, like... Showed up out of nowhere. Nice one, dude. Thank you. You're going to have to give him a little toss. Just so muddy. All right, y'all. We are in for the day. We had a good time. We caught some pretty good fish. Also caught some really small ones. I wish we would have caught some bigger bass, but we still caught some good ones. Had some awesome drag rips. The way that the fish were biting was just crazy. I mean, you would hook a pound to two pound fish. And it would literally feel like it's a five, six pounder. So, I mean, it was a lot of fun, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please hit the like button, share this video with a friend, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I appreciate the love and support, and I'll catch you all in the next video.